Welcome to The Big Three from Arizona State University. I'm Veronica Sanchez. Today's edition covers graduation day. Thousands expected to walk during spring commencement. We'll introduce you to our graduates and the big name speakers set to inspire. ASU ushers in a new era of design study with a renowned partner in Los Angeles. And the Water Initiative launches. We'll tell you how the university is using discovery, innovation, and action to solve the water crisis. Let's begin the big three. Number one, the caps and gowns have been ordered. More than 19,000 students are graduating during spring commencement ceremonies. They'll be earning more than 20,000 degrees. That's a 6% increase from last year's ceremonies. Among the impressive graduates, a doctorate in engineering for a young woman who is shattering stereotypes in the field. She's a plus-size model, a social media influencer, and a member of a black sorority. A nursing graduate who traveled all the way to Malawi to help elevate health care in the region. And a 14-year-old ASU online student graduating with a Bachelor of Science and Sociology, as well as a former migrant student earning a whopping four degrees. U.S. Surgeon General Vice Admiral Vivek Murthy will be speaking to under graduate students in the evening of May 8th, and broadcast journalist Judy Woodruff will address graduates in the morning. Here's the message Woodruff sent to students on social media. Hi, I'm Judy Woodruff of the PBS NewsHour, and I couldn't be more honored or more excited to be addressing the graduate school commencement this spring at Arizona State University. What an impressive group. I can't wait to be there to congratulate you and to share a few thoughts on why the world can't wait for you to jump in and start making a difference. I'll see you on May the 8th. Number two, some exciting expansion and fashion news for students at ASU and in LA. The Fashion Institute of Design and Merchandising in downtown Los Angeles, or FIDM as it's called, will be part of fashion education at the Herberger Institute for Design and the Arts at ASU. ASU's fashion program will now be named ASU FIDM, incorporating both the FIDM community and campus, and it will operate in both LA and Arizona. FIDM will remain a separate educational institution from ASU with a greater focus on academic programs related to businesses in the creative industries. Number three, ASU launches the Water Initiative, designed to bring innovation and action to the fight for the future of our water. State water officials and members of the ASU community, including President Michael Crow, celebrated the official launch of the initiative, which is funded by a $40 million investment from the state and a $5 million gift from the Virginia G. Piper Charitable Trust. ASU officials are working with industrial, municipal, agricultural, tribal, and international partners to develop water solutions. They include new approaches, technology for water conservation, efficiency, and infrastructure. That's it for ASU's Big Three Stories. Want to use our video? Just credit Arizona State University. And if you'd like to schedule an interview to cover stories featured here, we can help. Also, ASU has more than 300 experts you can talk to on deadline. Just click on the Media Relations and Strategic Communications page and look for an expert or reach out to me. Also, check out the ASU News Twitter page daily for stories and updates. That does it for Arizona State's Big Three. Thanks for watching and forks up.